Behind me, Mr. Tom Vandergriff, the man who fought for the Texas Rangers in the 50s. This World Series win, profoundly personal for his family, who were here last night to cheer alongside the fans who've supported this dream from the beginning. He wanted to see people celebrate like they were doing last night. Like he wanted to see those smiles and those tears and you know, the grandfather, they're hugging the grandson. I mean, that's that's why he did it. Parker Vandergriff wanted to do the same Wednesday evening at Globe Life Field. I knew that was the first thing I had to do. Parker embraced the statue of his grandfather, the late Tom Vandergriff, also known as the father of baseball in Arlington. The reality for Rangers fans, we wouldn't be here without Tom Vandergriff. And we're, it's the only reason, like you said, that we're celebrating the World Series. I mean, it began in 1958. Um, as a lone dream. Vandergriff served Arlington and Tarrant County for half a century as mayor, U.S. congressman, and county judge. During his time as Arlington's mayor, Vandergriff was the driving force on ensuring a Major League Baseball team called Arlington its home. It took years of pitching a plan for a pro team, but in 1972, Vandergriff's vision came true. There's a photo we've got from 1972 where he's holding a, a photo that says World Series 72 when they came here, thinking that the World Series might be coming the first year that they're here, you know, not knowing that it would take 51 years later until it finally happens. This is Parker Vandergriff throwing the ceremonial first pitch at a game wearing a City Connect uniform. The Rangers say those uniforms honor Tom Vandergriff's vision, optimism and resilience for paving the way for the Rangers coming to Arlington. And even though his grandfather wasn't able to witness the World Series win, Parker says his presence is felt, especially come Friday when a sea of red, white and blue will cover the very grounds Mr. Tom Vandergriff believed in. It's always been Arlington's push to get baseball. So it, it absolutely should be here, right? I mean, now, of course, time has gone by and people don't know the history of the Rangers, but, you know, we, we love, you know, fans from all over North Texas, but it started in Arlington. The Vandergriff family will be here tomorrow at the parade, which will take place just steps away from Tom Vandergriff's statue. In Arlington, Peyton Yeager, Fox 4 News.